Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup available. <laughs> Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's dad, wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen. Saying she can't wait to see us at the party! What? Really? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So... So what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself.
Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. <sighs> Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you wanna hit or not? Yeah, okay. It's Friday. Thanks for making me smoke again. Oh, then I'll make sure you don't smoke any weed tonight. Deal? <laughs> Deal. <laughs> Can't wait to see you baked as hell trying to pull this off. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa! What the hell are don't you doing? Don't move! You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All oh, right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C-O-N-D-O... -O. Oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> you wish. Uh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. 
Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week or your poor suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad, dad, dad. What is this? Mm. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. He sucks. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Yeah, I have to work in my room too. Yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> okay, let's get this party list started. Better pack for the party. I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but <laughs> not tonight. What if Jen came over? Mm, we can build a fire and... <sighs> Dude, stop. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. I don't know who plays more. Daniel or Dad. I'm not that into cars, but these are pretty bitching. If things go well, should I bring Jen back here? Maybe Dad won't like her, or she won't like him. Or worse, she could get along with Daniel. Dude, stop. I'm not even dating her. Yet.
That's right. Qué pendejo. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Dad should just sell that other bike. That you, Choco Thief? It's me, Daniel. Cool. Can you tell your big brother he's grounded tonight when you see him? Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, shoot. Must be somewhere else, then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. <sighs> Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Calloway is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. <sighs> prejudiced against Vonnegut. Is that it? Yes, this is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade, art, Athletics, engineering, I don't care, as long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Ugh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock-blocking is. He looks up to you, Jean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um... By the way... Ha! I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Ah, 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 ah. Shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? 
Um, I mean, yeah, probably. But we'll be parting at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Oh, my God. Not when you call yourself like that. Uh, I get it. Too lame to hug the old man. Been there. All right, then. Get out of here, Mr. Cool. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood. Even though he won't... Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. <laughs> Daniel kept saying, I'm freezing! But we couldn't get him off the skis. What the? Is Dad... baking something? Meet the Diaz. Organization experts. Real funny, Dad. I can spare a few bucks for next week's pizza night. You're coming with me. Maybe this is better. Cross that off the list. Food down, drinks to go. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. Looks like I got everything. At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. He was so proud to get that. He should be. Damn. The guy never stops working. Hey, Jen. What's up? Oh, try again, loser. Hey, you look totally hot. Oh my god, stop. Oh. Hey, you wanna share my blanket? Hey, Jen. Do you wanna hang out sometime? 
Not bad. Remember, don't be too thirsty. Well, it's not my turn to do the laundry. Dude, come on, open up. Why? Because. Okay, okay. What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You ate my choco, Chris. Don't be pissed. You always see the whole box. What's with the scissors? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Oh, man. Damn, sounds pretty serious. Should I call an ambulance now before it's too late? Maybe. <laughs> All I can say is watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is going to be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. Did she ask about me? <sighs> I'm sorry, dude. She's cheating on you. Shut up! And I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. Daniel's always up to something. Wonder what's next. How many times have I watched it? Not enough. Asshole. Time to get in the mood for tonight. That would be sick. That would cut my arm off if I got a tat like that. But when I turn 18, I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. Lila will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. I've looked in it. Time to draw now. Turn your light on the flip of this coin. Turn upside the choice you normally avoid. Promise me, follow what you say. The lighting is nice. It's been a while since I've sketched my room. Ruff looks cool. Messy. Should I keep going? Time to take the pen, dude. My room almost looks cool on this. Not an easy task. Good job. I think I know what to ask for Christmas. I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it looks pretty rad. Told them not to take a picture of me after the race. <laughs> I look like a soul never make varsity at this rate. Damn. I still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. Oh. Hi, Gunther. Sorry. You stay hidden here. We... 
got these for free during sex ed. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want me to pay for it? Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. My first hangover. Dad laughed at me so hard when I came back home. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. We almost got caught by a crazy old dude, but it was such a blast. This was such a cool day. Can't wait to go back out there with the crew. Finally, ready to go. Time to sk Finally. Now I can Skype with Lila. T Time to get this party started. boy. Just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. <laughs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? Well... I don't know. Play it cool, talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh, oh my god. You did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. So what? I don't have any game. These are uncharted territories for me. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's, um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, uh, Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out of what? me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. Anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? But... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. <sighs> sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. Oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night... Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time... Don't get caught. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? <laughs> That's a girl thing, no? Let me see that drawing. Hold on. Ugh. 
This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Oh shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh. You will see. It's for Halloween. OMG. You gave her an LOL? <laughs> that is a ballsy move. So what? I'm a funny guy. Are you? I better warn her. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey. Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Dude, step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, <laughs> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! <sighs> Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <sighs> you and your whole fucking family are going to jail! Losers! What? What's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean! Is he hurt? Okay! Okay, step away! Now! Calm down, <gasps> officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating me. up my little brother! Now! Hands behind your Sean. head! This is fucking bullshit! Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Get on the ground! Sir. Dad! We didn't do Sean, anything! Sean, be quiet! I swear! Officer, Sean! Listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad! Daddy! Be quiet! I wanna go home! They're good kids, Officer! Don't move! I'm sure they didn't do I anything! I don't move! We didn't Daniel, do anything! It's gonna be alright! On the ground!
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being at home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? So come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you, okay? Okay, but I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know, I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome pots. But next time, Dad better give me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, hm. a Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah. Yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once. Huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no. run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Blah!
we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp at. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Oh, look! A car Man, out here? It's so dirty. Hope the driver isn't around watching us. Huh? What do you find? Check it out! There's a chunky chocolate crisp bar on the dashboard! Yeah, I see it. You know I love Choco Crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get one when we stop next? Please? Let's take this one. Nobody's gonna miss one single Choco Crisp bar. Really? I would. This is for a good cause. Oh, uh, almost. I got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have dessert. Come on, let's beat it. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be fine. I'm sure there's no bear around here. <sighs> I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us for the Choco Chris? And they're hunters! You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Welcome to Nowhere, Washington. Yay. Now we can see where we are. Whew, there's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No, duh. It's way too cold for your skinny butt. Okay. That showed me how to read these when I was eight. Daniel, check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. If only Dad was here. Stop thinking about that. <sighs> okay, dude. You have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh, well, maybe I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. Especially after you use it. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, uh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did! I built the biggest cities ever! Ooh! I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Man, what are we doing out Where here? Are we going? 
Hmm. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. Whoa. That place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I don't think Daniel understands what's going on. Ooh, Sean! Let's play hide and seek! Bet you can't find me. No, not right now. We stick together. Ugh. You're no fun. Not today, I'm not. Sorry. Whatever. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. Hey! I think this path leads to the river. What if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet. Oh, man. Raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah. <gasps> That's one big tree. Okay. Now it's your turn. Hop on down. I'll catch you. How come nobody is out here? Huh? It's October. People don't hike as much. So why are we? Because we can. We're badass warriors, dude. Dude, I found some berries. Come get some. Cool. I'm so hungry. Ooh, juicy. Hey, Daniel, you hear that? Is that a bird's nest? Oh, yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. Come on. We're too big for a nest. Ugh. Um, this is pretty high up. Uh, Sean, can you, uh... Come on, I got you. <clears throat> Phew, thanks. See that? Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Uh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> Stop it. What the hell is that? Ugh, I should have listened in biology class. You struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! Uh, I saw your face. That was, uh, surprise. Maybe you scared me for like one second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie.
Ooh. Looks like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're going to stay in there? I don't know. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. Cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right! Yes! Uh, so what do we need? Uh, you know, shit to make a fire. Um, twigs, branches. Are you sure we can do this? Who can stop us? Nobody. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming! Hey, Sean! Let's have a race. Whoever finds three lods is the winner. Cool? <laughs> okay. You're brave to challenge me. So let's do it. No way you're gonna beat me. Yes, here's number two. Now this is perfect. Ooh, Daniel is in it to win it. Nice and dry. That's enough for a toasty fire. All right, how much you got? It's all there. Yeah, okay. That should be enough for the night. <laughs> See, told you. I won. All right. We have a little time to explore before we light up the fire. Cool. I'll go check the river. Man, this place is like our own giant camp. We should catch some fish for dinner. Those are bear claws. I'm not gonna tell Daniel. Fish, fish. Come out, fish, fish. What are you doing, mountain boy? I'm gonna catch a fish to put. Nice. But we should wait until we get some gear or something. I can do it. Just watch. I know. We'll come back later. Okay. You promise? Promise. 
Feels good to focus on something after all that shit. I wish Noah was out here with me. We could build a fort. Time to take the pen, dude. I think I'm ready to draw this. Okay, got it. Dad gave me the sketchbook. He was so fucking awesome. Shoot, he... Oh. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Time to take the pen, dude. This almost looks like a peaceful memory. Almost. Get it. I won't skip. Watch me. Dude, come on. That's a boulder, not a rock. Here, you need a flat rock. Hold it like this. Look at my hand. Boom. Okay, I did it. My turn. Hold it with your thumb and finger. And spin your wrist when you throw. Most. What I do wrong? Not bad. Give it another try. Uh, so close. Try again. You've almost got it. Getting into the zone. Don't give up now. I did it! I did it! Did you see? <laughs> oh, yeah. That was awesome. I think you're ready for the Olympic stone skipping team. He thinks we're just going on a trip. I can't imagine when he'll find out what really happened. I ran into a web like that when I was a kid. Oh, you want to challenge Ew. me? Behold my sword! On guard, Sir Daniel. But I'm fighting the tree, not you! The light will purge you! Uh, you're not fun, Sean. You know you're bigger than me. Not fair. I've had enough nature for one day. Not today. Ooh, we can yell as much as we want. Hey, can we build a fire now? 1986? Damn, that's ancient. Better not let Daniel wait around. He's too tired.
All right, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. Okay. Can I help? <sighs> you have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes! Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. Wish we had more. I know. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm. Do you want a piece? Ah, uh, I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now. Not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. <laughs> Figures you try to get revenge, Judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. Mmm. Mmm. So good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Oh, dude. dude. That shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. <laughs> I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. Promise. I could really use a smoke. Good I took those and not the beers. Daniel needed this sugar rush. How long have we been out Still here? Still no reception. Of course. I'm bored. Sean, can I play Mustard Party on your phone? Please. No reception, so go for it. Yeah, thanks. Oh, I'm so gonna beat your score. <sighs> Aw, come on. Almost. I was so gonna beat your score. You wish. Stupid phone. Look, a full moon. Ooh! 
<laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Dude, we are the wolves. Ow! See? Ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! You okay, buddy? Feels good to sit down. Sean, are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. We got in a fight. Did you kick his ass? Yeah, but nobody won. It's not like the movies, Daniel. Man, I made a fire tonight. That would be proud. Uh, We're almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? I'm so tired. Wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. You look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> Better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you're like a... a real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. Why won't stay open, Sean? Sleep tight, bro. Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sh Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here, in the park. Remember our amazing fire? Fine. I'm right here. Don't worry. Okay. I won't. As long as you're here. Go... go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might have another scary dream. 
You won't. I'm here. Just... Just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. A four secret milkshake factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Oh. Remember that time? Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like his. So he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. <sighs> I'm sorry, you know. I should have listened. You did stand up for me. Hey! There's something ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and Utah. You're a long way from home. Dude, I hear you. We're gonna... How can someone drive with this mess? I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and... Plus a map. So we can find the best route. All right. Hey. I have a special quest for you. What? You have to go ask that nice family for some food. What? No way, Jose. Why me? Sean, I don't want to do this. You're older. But you're cuter. Even Lila thinks so. You're awesome with people. Yeah, but I'm asking for their food. Like we're homeless or something. Uh, no. We're just foodless. Okay, I'll do it. What do I say? Just be yourself. But don't tell them anything about us. Except, uh, we're camping. And hungry. Okay. Whoa, you did it. I knew you could do it, man. The mom was nice. The dad was kind of a weenie. But we got chips. You kicked serious ass. And I'm allowed to say that. It's weird. This will be my first Halloween away from home. It sucks I can't do Halloween now. Can't even check my it's goddamn bad. voicemail here. There's nothing. California plates. Maybe they can help us. Sean, you sure it's okay to poke around? Do they make actual money doing this?
Hello there. Hey. Beware the Halloween witch. Hey, man, check this out. Power Bear Claw? Uh, can we play? I bet it's easy to get a prize. Yeah, no. See all those prizes still inside? Nobody wins except the machine. Oh. Uh, but hey, we're the Wolf Brothers. Us teach this machine a lesson, right? Yes. So, who goes first? <laughs> Let your big brother take the first shot, okay? No one can defeat justice. Okay. Well, you better grab that prize. Let me get in the zone. Here we go. Almost. Beware can I play? Please, please, please. Let me just give it one more try. Okay. But if you don't get it... You got it? Uh, Our team is going to now? win every battle. Sure. But don't beg. Get that prize. Just watch me. Let's go, Power Bear Claw. Wait till you get a good opening. Not there. It sucks. Don't grab so fast. Let's see. This is hard. <sighs> Can you try? Generation. <sighs> yeah, okay. Let's see what I can do. Yeah. Come on, Sean. Beat that stupid machine. Wow! Can't believe you did it so easy. Ooh, let's see, let's see. So cool. Sean, look. Bet you're the first one to get a prize out of here. Told you nobody beats a Diaz. Right. I'll just bust out my platinum card. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. And he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Of course they did. Weird to Why the fuck not? After the forest. Like another world. I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Ah, uh, no. I don't mean... I mean... It's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just... naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Yeah, we're on the road, going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. 
The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. Don't worry, we'll get you a new family soon. Man, look at all that food. Dude. I know. What are you doing over there? Sean, what are you doing? Hi, what are you looking at? Oh, hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh, not for you. Why? Like, dirty stuff? Yeah. It's, uh, adult stuff. I'm not... Hey, hi. Good evening. Yes, can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. Oh, we're on a, a road trip. I see. So you came here to bother my customers? No, no way. We just asked them for directions. So where are your parents? We're with our dad. Hmm, that makes sense. How come he's not here with you? He... went hiking. So he told us we could hang out and explore. He's leaving you out here during a road trip? Doesn't he care about you? Yeah, no. Don't worry. It's super fine. Yeah, if you say so. Sean, check it out. It's a Ratchoon costume. I want to be a Ratchoon. Daniel, come check this out. What? What is it? It's a puppy. Super cute. <laughs> yeah, super cute. Is this yours? No. Just another stray mutt. Aww, he must be sad. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? <sighs> Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah, it would be so cool. Come on. We need adults to take care of her, not kids. I know. I just thought we could. I'd love to. She's right. We can't take care of a dog right now. Hey, what about that? We could use that. No way I can steal something this big. Who sends postcards? Boring. I'm Daniel. So what exactly are you doing all the way out here? <sighs> nah. She keeps looking at me. I'm fucked. There must be a way I can distract her from watching me. Oh, no. I won't take any credit for the bears. That's all on my husband. He won't stop making them. Oh, no matter how much I beg. Oh, I think they're so cute. Well, good for you. Sure glad somebody does. <laughs> I should turn this thing off. Is she laughing at him? Hey, man, um, can you go talk to her? Uh, just ask her stuff uh, like you always do. Hey, not fair. You already made me talk to these guys outside. Why should I do it again? So I can shop alone. Sean, 
You better not steal again. You better not. Shh. Watch it. Just bug her, okay? Please. Jeez, okay. But you better be careful. Hi. Okay. She's focused on Daniel. Just do it, man. You were? Why? I don't know. I wanted to know how those tiny pumps can hold so much gasoline. Oh, I see. You did it. We have these big tanks on And she didn't see you. So how do you get the gas? In and out. With big tanker trucks. You've seen those before, right? Uh, yeah. My dad haunts at them. When they get in the way at the pump. <sighs> Shit. And us. Daniel's standing right the there. Story. That's, uh, cool. I can't take this. How long She'll see me. Have you... have... this gas station? I'm a little busy right now working. So excuse me. Oh, right. Uh, sorry. Can't go wrong with these. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring power you up. Bear is amazing. And there's I'm the like damage. This in my room. Go, Power Bear. There you go. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Hey, look, empty table. Uh, let's grab it and check out this map. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? This is a ton of food. I thought we were broke. Not today, Dan. So let's rub out. This is our trick. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. To be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. Nope, this can't be here. Um, definitely not there. Damn, where can this be? Nope, this can't be here. All right, this is it. Are you sure? Yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Aww, but it looks cool. Hold on, I'll find where we can go. Hey kids, 
Looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it's okay. Look, our, our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, Don't touch my brother! a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh, shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. Are you sure about this, Hank? I don't know. And they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then. Well, I'll let you deal with it. Oh, hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm American. Mm. Uh, shut up, thief. You're on my land, and I didn't ask you to come rip me off. You're lucky my wife didn't catch you. She's the gun collector in her family. Whatever. I'm going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out into the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Plastic. what I thought. Fuck. Daniel must be scared shitless. 
I can't leave him out there. Okay. Looks like he's gone for now. Wonder if I could get more light from it. Yes. That's a little better. Yeah, we get it. You're the perfect Americans. Sean! Sean! Where are you? I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines. Oh, yeah. Daniel? I'm right here! Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods, but... I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful, it might attract him. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. It won't open, it's locked. What do I do? I don't know. Let me think. Hey, the old guy's gone. M maybe you can enter from the store door. Oh, check it out. It was closed. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Sean. I'm really scared. Don't be. I'm... I'm right here, okay? Just hold tight. Don't run off. Can you try and open this vent? Yes. Ouch. It hurts. Sorry, Sean. I won't move. Don't worry. We'll figure something out. <sighs> of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Sean? Is there bears out in the woods right now? Right. <sighs> okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can... Get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. I, I think I saw a big file thing in the workshop with all those bear sculptures. I know you can find it. Okay, I'll try. This is it! You rule, Daniel! Come on, 
Let's do this. Yes! Good job, bro. Cut this off, fast. How about these? Dude, you rock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. The hell with you. Get out of here. Come on. Come on. Wait. Shit. Where are we going? Sean. Watch out. Over there. Let's go. I don't know. Oh, what are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me. You guys okay? You don't look okay. That asshole at the gas station. We're fucking crazy. He tied me up in his back office. I swear. Dude, say no more. I believe you, okay? Shit's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you two. Hurry up before he catches us. was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. He was a total fucking dickhead. Man, it felt good to beat his ass. Whoa, kid. Maybe he deserved it, but don't do it and don't talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Sorry. I'm just still pissed off. Welcome to Redneck Land. 
This ain't Seattle no more. Yeah. My dad said there are more Bigfoots out here than Mexicans. No doubt. People out here are more scared of you and your little brother. This is nuts. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? We <laughs> saved her. We're heroes. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But you said that maybe we could. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. He's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. <sighs> just, just stop. <sighs> you win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet and... And, and what should we name her? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Eh, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you like famous or something? <laughs> More like or something. People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Well, that's enough for me. <laughs> Sounds pretty awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious.
Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call, no pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Your shithead neighbor was picking on him. I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> fucking cops. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. And I didn't even get to hug my dad the last time I saw him. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere and you're taking the brunt of it right now but you're gonna be okay sean no i'm not my life feels like like that town down there wiped out destroyed empty like i have nothing What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I can't. Isn't it better if he doesn't know? If I found out, he's gonna find out. Better he hears it from you. I wish I could change everything back. So none of it ever happened. I... I just don't know what to say. But I'll try. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it, go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. Should I go back to Seattle? Maybe I can try and explain everything. What happened? You should do what you think is best. If going to Mexico seems like the right thing to do, then so be it. You're going in the right direction. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the US, except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's... out of the picture. But dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Listen, 
I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. <laughs> okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <sighs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? We're so lucky Brody helped us. If it wasn't for him, we... Too bad sandcastles never last. Guess I could play a little with these two. Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. <laughs> Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, mushroom. Get it. Go, mushroom. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. You go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Get that stick! Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody, to... You're not leaving? Are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody.
Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. Okay, good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If you're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice and warm. <sighs> this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad, but too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Wanna play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw, shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Hey, a deal's a deal. Sorry, little bro. You gotta accept Aww. it. Aw. Okay. Don't start pouting. Come on. I'm not. All right. I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pidgey. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure, Cave Boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Uh, is it all right if I sit in your bed and watch TV? A ch uh. Is it all right if...
This cigarette with Lila seems so far away. It's nice out here. Wish I cared. Puerto Lobos, Mexico. Can I get us this far? And safe? How can we get there without money? And Daniel still doesn't know what really happened. How the fuck am I gonna tell him? Let's put this in the bathroom for Prince Daniel. <sighs> Daniel, you have towels in the bathroom. Don't forget to use yeah, them. Yeah. Fill her up. Sean, it's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey, don't. Daniel will love this. One bubble bath coming up. Brother of the month. <sighs> yeah, right. Ah, damn. That fucking redneck hit me hard. <sighs> I hit him harder, though. Hey, Daniel. Bath's ready. What? Already? Can I finish this episode first? <laughs> no, man. You smell so bad, there's no time to lose. Oh. Hey, you smell too. Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking a bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he saw me. Time to say goodbye to modern life. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this? Or she'll get into trouble, too. Sean? Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. With Daniel. <laughs> Shit! Everyone's looking for you here. Fuck. I didn't do anything. I know. God, this is so messed up. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. 
I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. You know I wish I could, but we can't take that risk. They're, they're gonna put me in juvie. And Daniel... Bullshit. You're innocent. And I've got your back. No matter what. No way. I'm not gonna let you get in trouble for me. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. I guess the freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So, where are you going? Um, we're just going away for now. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. <sighs> okay. Wait. Okay, okay. And action. What in here right now? What? What did I do? You forgot to open this present. <laughs> what is this? Socks? Underwear? That's it? Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? That's what I got when I was a kid. <sighs> Not funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. Dude, check out your face. Wait, what? What? There's another one here. What is it? Daniel, let me help. Looks bigger than underwear. Oh, what? No way. Okay, don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Come on, dance! Man, I, I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel, uh... Come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a coat. Or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal? Daniel. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Daniel! What's happening? Daniel, calm down! You lied! Dad! Our dad is dead! Why? Calm down, Daniel. Let's just talk, please. You knew Dad was dead. You knew it. Why? Why did you lie to me? I was scared, Daniel. I didn't know what to say. You, you should have told 
I couldn't believe it either. I didn't mean to. I hate you! Not my brother! Don't say that. I know I messed up everything. We're gonna get through this. Daniel, please! Oh. It's okay. I want that. <sighs> Me too. <laughs> We were gonna see you, Dad. I'm sorry. I just... Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. <laughs> what are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Sean, am I a monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're different. Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where Dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. He used to tell me bedtime stories too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together
All right. Come on, man. Focus. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. 